Hello everyone, welcome to another YouTube video from me here. Today I just mainly want to show you a little tricks of how to remove the magazine of a 6 CD player stacker like um, like this one here. This one here is in a Honda but it's made by Alpine and you can see in the background there there are also most of them so here like it's all made by Alpine as well. You can see the similarity here. You can see all this button here yeah except the top one here that's all but first of all this one here is made by Chrysler this is Chrysler here then we've got BMW then you've got a Mercedes one and to the left here we've got more Mercedes one original Alpine one and another BMW one okay and this front one here right here in front of us here this is an Honda one you can see there basically it's got a 6 CD player for example if you've got a 6 CD magazine in there it's like this it's inside it's got uh, this magazine here and the way you see it is like this inside when it's inside it's like this if you ever got one it's jammed inside the car and then you try to press a button it's not coming out for example and um, if for whatever reason you know you, you want to remove the magazine there's some others there's, there's, depends on the issue of the unit of course um if it's just a, if it just um, nothing wrong much with it if for example if the magazine stuck in there label you know you got a, a, a cd that you sure it's got a, some kind of label on top of the actual this for example it's got a label on top of it and then causing the issue you know i often come with come across some people that put some labels in there and they put, uh, put it inside and what happens some of these labels sometimes it's causing the issue it's coming loose and then it's jammed inside there okay so you know just show you just very quickly how to remove it out now you don't need any special tool at all basically there's a few things and if for example it's only a little thing like this look I got this mainly what you need is something a bit you know about that size the width of it is about five centimeters four or five centimeters and the length is about 20 to 25 for example just a piece of sturdy plastic it's a reasonable sturdy that's all you don't need something too soft you know at least if you can get your hand onto a piece what I've in my case for example I happen to find a, uh, like a, a crayon and, and, and a texture type sort of thing like this from my children they, they, they they're coming on with this tray in here you can see there and basically what I did is just, I just nip up a little piece here from there, that's all, okay? That is one piece, for example, if you want to, you don't have anything else, you got that. Or, if you've got a spare folder, like, you know, this sort of folder like this, I just snip up a piece of this like, like that, for example, okay? So that basically, that's, that's all the two you need, okay? So either that or this blue one. The blue one here is a little bit more stronger, but you know, either way, you know, you, you tried it. If it doesn't work, then then you try the, 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 other, the other one. For example, you can see there, for example, here, all you have to do, just go under this magazine. This is the, the 60 CD magazine here. Just try to get underneath here, underneath there, right, and poke all the way in, all the way inside the, 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 there. And then you basically try to move it that way. So along this guy here, you go there and then you slide it across. You go up, push it all the way in, and then you try to move it that way. So when you hit that piece there, that will eject the magazine. Now I just try to show you now what I do. I go under the under the, the CD here, magazine there. But I put all the way in. You go go from the right hand side. Pull from the right hand side there. All the way in, you don't hit any, uh, nothing there to be hit anyway, so all the way in. Now, you swing it to the left. Basically, try to hold a bit straight like this, swing it to the left, and there. That come out like that, easy like that, okay? So try it again, go there. Go underneath the magazine, all the way in, and then slide to the left. And try to hold it a bit sturdy like this. Okay? then the magazine will pop out like that. The reason for that is, if you look carefully all the way inside there, there's a little lever there. 
It's actually the leaf is inside. I don't know how well can you see that. Basically, it's just a little piece of plastic there to hold onto this magazine here. Okay, so you push it in like that, that will magazine come out. That being said, not all magazine will come out. Some of them is require some repair. But if you, for example, if you got a tray with a CD like this, and it's already stuck like this all together. For example, you got a this in, it's in the play mode, it's sitting inside there like this, right? And you try to force it, ejecting like this, go underneath there and go out like this, it will not come out because this magazine is on this side. So it will not come out. You come out, this thing here will hit in here, and that's it. The whole uh, magazine will not come out. If you manage to get it out, it's stuck here, you just push it back in. Then, it's a bit more work involved. You have to dismantle the whole unit. And then, basically, you have to do the repairs. If you want to go further than that, then it basically that's how you have to roll this one back in. Roll the, the, there's a gear under there. You roll it until this one come back all the way inside. Like that. Then, you just go the same way. And this magazine will pop out. Okay. So, this, in this video, is basically, this is the, the, the Alpine one. I just show you, they're using a lot of different type of cars, more than here, but I just show you roughly what that one is. The same thing, if you happen, if your one happened to be like a Eurowax like this, but the brand is called Eurowax, they're using a fair bit of cars as well, in Audi, in VW, in Holden, in uh, BMW as well, yes, BMW, Mercedes too, yes, they use this as well. If you ever have a magazine like that, it's the same way. It's easier. This way here, you don't have to slide all the way to all the all, all the way in. All you have to do is just slide it in a little bit, like that. And then you swing to the left. Okay, bring it to the left. And then you just push it straight in. That will come out, okay? So this one's slightly different to the one down the bottom. The reason for that is that all you have to do is just try to get... Just imagine that. Imagine this piece go inside there, right? You go all the, uh, like this, and then you spring it to the left. Use that as a guy. You push, slide it, slide like that to go in, and the magazine will pop out. Okay? And inside there, if you look closely, there's got a little hole under here. So this piece here is actually hold the magazine. When you push it in, there's a piece inside there. It go up and it's locking this magazine here. like that slide to the left and push it all the way in and that will come out okay now this one it's a little bit easier if for example if you got a disc inside there play in the play mode it's inside the, the unit there you eject this right this will come out there's one disc is still in there for example if you got a disc inside Okay, you have a look across inside here, then see if you see a disc inside there or not. Or you can feel it with your fingers, you can see if there's a disc in there. Okay, if the disc in there, and then for example, you got, this is a 10 disc magazine in here. If you have managed to pop this one out, try to remove every single disc out. Move every one of them out completely until it's empty. Then, you can try to push it back in. And if it's okay, if it works, for example, it will bring that disc back to the to the inside the magazine there. Then, hopefully, if there's nothing else, uh, major problem with it, and then it will come out. It it will work for you, okay? But just please bear that in uh, bear that in mind. When you pop this magazine out, remove all the discs out, okay? Every single one of them. Leave it empty like this. Then, if there's a disc in there, you poke it in, and if it come out, then it's come out. Okay, or if you want to just want to take the disc out and you, you don't care about the unit, just mainly you just want to uh, retrieve your disc inside here, and that's all you need to, to do. Okay, this I'm going to try today here mainly to show you how to a quick way of ejecting this, uh, the, the CD uh, the magazine coming out. Next video or so, I'm going to show you how to repair this one, and also we're going to how to repair this one as well. But in the meantime, I just want to make it short, so just a quick. Um, I'll show you how to remove the DC out, that's all. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. And I hope you that will help you in some way. Please subscribe and like. And if you want me to, uh, to show you any other unit, for example, to repair and things like that, please write down the bottom. And I will do my best.
to uh, put it, push it up for everyone to see as well. Okay, thank you.